Hi everyone, Pastor Chris, Amy, Justin, once again, it is Friday, October the 4th, and we're here to talk about what's going on at GBC this coming weekend. And as always, it's going to be a very packed weekend. Yes. But here in town, it's been really cool as well. We had mm -hmm. Taste of Marshall last night, we got the carnival here in town, right. lots of things happening in our little uh, metropolis of Marshall. Uh, we are now actually approaching 2,000 people wow. living in our town. I mean, <laughs> things are really going crazy. And that's great because that's also more opportunities for people to visit. Definitely. GBC. Yeah. And yeah. we are excited about that. Mm -hmm. So this weekend, we're going to be finishing up uh, the section in Colossians chapter 3, and then we'll hit back into Acts chapter 19 next weekend, and we'll have family church at 9, yep. we'll do kids yes. church at 1030, <laughs> yeah. and we're just looking forward to an out, just a really outstanding weekend. Justin, mm -hmm. you're not meeting this weekend, right? Yeah, bear with us. So we'll have middle school this Sunday, no high school. The next Sunday we'll have high school, but no middle school. So we'll And be... one of the reasons for that is you guys are looking forward yeah. to doing a family, but yet yeah. personally uh, enriching and challenging yes. time as well. Where do you, where are you going to be? Yeah, Courtney and I, we're headed out to the uh, the Pastors Leaders Conference at the Ark Encounter. Awesome. So that's going to be a lot of fun. That's we'll travel Monday and then Tuesday through nice, Thursday, nice. three day, two and a half, three day event there. And That'll then, be fun. Yeah, we're going to yeah. enjoy the, the Ark and then head up to the Creation Museum on Friday. So fun. It'll be a lot of fun. Yeah. Great opportunity. Mm -hmm. He's been out there a couple of times. If you're interested, not only in the length of the trip, but, but all of the different interactions that are out there, particularly if you have younger kids, right. he is the guy to talk to. Uh, great materials from them as well. There'll be super speakers at this event, so I'm excited for him as well as getting all the feedback once he returns. Now, mm -hmm. I I'm going to be kind of by my lonesome Are. during the week because <laughs> Amy also has an upcoming trip. Yeah. Uh, yeah. She and Josh are going to be gone for several days, and so we're going to be we're going to be just battening down the hatches here. <laughs> from Keep basically Monday him. through Friday. <laughs> right, so listen, with these two out of here, any help you're willing to give me, I'm willing to take it, okay? So just be thinking about that. Yeah. Now, this coming Sunday, we're also going to address, of course, the situations yeah. that is happening in the southeastern states as a result of Hurricane Helene. And so many people are trying to do so many wonderful different things. Absolutely. There's confusion, though, at times on where you can get or you can't get and mm -hmm. who's doing what. We're going to kind of talk to you a little bit on Sunday about where are we as a church, what are some opportunities that are out there that you can participate in right now that have already been vetted, right. and what is maybe a kind of a long-term idea that we have that we'll share with you about uh, adopting a small town down in North Carolina, but we'll right. share more about that with you yeah. over the weekend on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Now, in the meantime, you've got all kinds of small group stuff. Yeah, we do. Happening, right? Yeah, lots going on. With the kids, we're going to be learning about the importance of being in fellowship at a church and that a church is not just a building. That's what we're doing with the children. And then also their memory verses. Small groups, we have a 6 a.m. Bible study that's going along with what's going on on Thursday. Right. Oh, now, your 6 a.m., when mm -hmm. does that meet? Is that Thursday itself That's, as well? Um, nope. It meets Wednesday, Wednesday, 6 a.m. Right. Online, though. And please invite anybody, not just for church members, but anybody. Right. Is and that is welcome. a, that again, is a women's study with right. Amy at 6 a.m. Mm -hmm. Now, we also have mommy group this week on Tuesday. We do, and I believe book club. Book club. Check our calendar, though. Yeah, so book got, club will be that right. night. And my wife, Barb, mm -hmm. will be uh, the, the teacher for mommy group yeah. as they go through the study. So exactly. the mommy group is going through the study. Mm -hmm. Amy's taking a group of women through the study right. on Wednesday mornings. And then there's two different studies for women right. on Thursdays. Exactly. Justin's leading young adults. He's leading a couple of other small groups. We've got a men's group on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. And then there's other groups all over the place. Again, so many ways we to cannot connect. emphasize yeah. enough, whether it's online, in-person, geographic area, right. making those mm -hmm. interpersonal connections exactly. are so important. Mm -hmm. All right, so there you have it. Lots <laughs> to be able to, to touch base in, including, oh, Justin, oh, I forgot. You're going to be instructing in Foundations again yes. this weekend as well at the 1030 service. Right. Yes. So if you're a part of Foundations, great. If you're just thinking, what is that? I'd like to just kind of test it out. Just jump into the class. It's right in his office, and uh, you can catch that at 1030 as well. Have a fantastic weekend, family, friends, different events that are going on. And the three of us, in the midst of all of the frenzy of activity, are going to look forward to seeing you guys 
concept. 